हेलो फ्रेंड वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल टुडे इन दिस वीडियो आई विल शो यू हाउ वी कैन क्रिएट लाइन एक्स पार्टीशन विद पार्टेड कमांड ऑन सेंटो सेवन देर आर डिफरेंट कमांड टू क्रिएट लाइन एक्स पार्टीशन लाइक एफ डिस्क एंड पार्टेड You cannot create a Linux partition larger than larger than 2 TB by using fdisk command, as fdisk cannot create partition larger than 2 TB. As fdisk command cannot handle the GPT partition tables, and parted support the GPT partition table, so we use parted command. to create partitions of size more than 2 tb in size it's fine to use fdisk command for normal users which uses partitions of 2 tb or less than 2 tb but if you are working on server then large partitions are required and we can fulfill that by using parted commands so let's start and see how we can create partitions more than 2 tb of size so let's start this is my linux machine having centos 7 and i have one disk attached of 3 tb in size so my system is having 3 tb of disk so we'll create partition on this stick on that this disk you can also check disk by using f disk like this so this showing that this disk is having 3 tb of disk run command parted then the disk name parted dev sdb now it show you this screen you can type help to check the available options here if you required any help you can use the command help suppose i'm just run parted command here from here also we can select disk like select dev sdv like this so in this way also you can select the disk now the next thing is next is we need to set the partition table type for this you can run help mk label here you can see the label type are showing here these are the different different label types so we need gpt here so we run mk label gpt like this it's say it's saying it's giving you a warning the existing disk label will be destroyed all data on this disk will be lost do you want to continue yes this will erase the disk and convert the disk into gpt okay now the next thing is let's check the disk space on this disk for this run uh, print free print free as you can see by default it showing the size in gb if you want to check in tb you can run like this for this you have to run use uh, unit tb and if you run again the command print free 
now it will show you the space in TV all right so let's create the partition for this you need to run command mk part primary primary partition file system type suppose I am using ext4 start I am starting with uh, 0 from the very first and end either you can use the complete one or you can use size custom size like I am using here 2 TB all right one net MK part all right now continue with yes yes ignore now print free as you can see the partition is created like this the 2 tv partition is created so it's create it have created one more here previously is with 00, zero. so if you want to remove the partition for this you need to run the command like rm and the partition number suppose i am removing the number 2 as you can see the partition is deleted now even if you want to delete this one you can run rm1 So all partitions are deleted. So in this way you can remove the partition. So let's create a partition once again. start with 0 and with 3.22 I am using the complete space as you can see the partition is successfully created so the partition is created now let's quit it and if we run it like this as you can see the partition is successfully created now the next thing is let's format this partition now all right our partition is ready now let's create one more mount point and mount this partition on test directory as you can see our partition is successfully created of 2.9 TV or you can say around 3 TV 3 TB of partition is created to make it permanent let's create an entry in fstep file like this 
let's run the command mount it's showing here it's mounted here let me unmount this and then again try to remount mount point is removed now here let's mount it again So again, we have successfully mount the partition on test. This mount hyphen A command will read the FSTF file and mount the partitions again. So in this way, you can use the parted command to create the Linux partition of more than 2 TB of size. So that's all in this video. If you like this video, then please like and subscribe my channel. Thanks for watching and have a good day.